First, delete the default cube and add an UV sphere. Change the number of segments to 16. In edit mode, select the bottom half and delete it. Now, go into modifiers and add a mirror modifier. Choose the Z-axis and allow clipping. Then, delete the top vertice. Select the vertices of the circle and click on bridge edge loops. Add a loop cut in the middle. Select these vertices and merge them together. Now, select the central vertices and scale them down. In edge select mode, select these edges and bevel them with three segments. Select less, and scale down the remaining faces. Then, switch to face select mode and create a new material named line. Click assign. Now, invert the selection and create another material named ball. Choose an orange color and click assign. Go to the shader editor. Add a bump node with 0.1 strength. Then, add a noise texture node. Scale it up to 60, detail to 10, and distortion to 0.5. Now, go back to the 3D viewport and apply the mirror modifier. Add a subdivision modifier and click apply. Shade auto smooth. Finally, go to render viewport. Congrats! You successfully made a basketball ball. If you're into sports, feel free to check out my other tutorials on tennis and soccer balls.